Tell you my favorite name for a local business is one about 60 miles east of here. I believe it's still there. Maybe it closed. It was in Baldwin, Wisconsin. It was called the Dull Funeral. <laughs> the Dull Funeral Home. I wonder if that's still around. It may have. It may have shut down. Quest Local, National, and 800 Directory Assistance. Quest now offers Canadian and Puerto Rican listings. For what city? Blink. For what listing? Louisiana. One moment. Raquel will be right with you. Hi, the city is blank. Wait a minute. I have that wrong. It's uh, Baldwin, Wisconsin. Okay. And how may I help you there? Dull Funeral Home, D-U-L-L. -L. Thank you very much. Touching Baldwin and surrounding area, I'm sorry we don't have a listing called Dull Funeral Home. How about the the boring morgue? Oh, we have O'Conley Family Funeral Home. That'll or, do. I'll take O'Conley. Or Young Funeral Home. <laughs> the Young Funeral Home. Well, I've got a corpse here that's 29. Let's go with that one. Okay. Here's that number. Okie dokie. Have a good night. You too. Thank you for using Quest. The number is area code. Write this seven down. One five Jason, seven, five. six. Eight, four, say four. four, six, four, six. Oh, that's an easy one. That's an easy one. Bach and Young Funeral Homes. Hi, I have uh, someone I was hoping you guys could pick up, but I just want to find out, are you guys just taking the young, or are you taking older people, or I just saw your name in the yellow pages? Um, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm not sure what your question is. Well, I just, um, are you, is it primarily just the young? Uh, no, we deal with all people. We're a full-service funeral provider. Okay. Because one guy told me that you might have an age discrimination thing or a line, a cutoff line. Uh, no, certainly not. Okay. So this, because the guy I'm dealing with here is 38. Okay. okay. Or 39. What do you do? I don't know. I'm not sure how old. Do you count the rings or what? Hello? Yes, I'm here. Uh, anyway, I need him to get out of here because it's... Okay. And who am I speaking with? This is Dave. Mm-hmm. And, and Dave, whom, whom are we talking about? Well, the guy here, his name, it says on his license, Oscar, and his last name is Wilker, W-I-L-K-E-R. Okay. Uh, okay, and, and where are you, Dave? I'm just out, out here, just in, on my porch right now. Okay, and, and where is your porch, well, Dave? about a block from where you guys are. Okay, and what's... Could I have that address? Yeah, it's, uh, hang on. What does it say on the door? 1742 5th. 5th Street? Yeah. Okay. And, uh, have you notified the authorities, or? Well, they just said to call you guys when I called them, because, I mean, it isn't foul play or anything. The guy's just, I don't know, he's just, he's not Something's wrong. <laughs> okay, and, and Dave, uh, what's your phone number there? 646-3232. Mm -hmm. 646-3232. Yeah, it's easy to remember because 32 is, that's the number often for half packs in the NFL. Okay. Like OJ was 32 and there are other guys who were three. I don't know what Rocky Blyer was. but. Okay, and uh, in, in what town are you in, Dave? What city are you in? I'm answering for a couple of different funeral oh. homes tonight, so... Oh, you're just an answering service. Well, no, I'm the funeral director, but, but we... Oh, well, there's a shortage of workers, because it used to be you could just find a guy at every one. Yep, and... Uh, the, the, well, which one are you at? Cause well... So you're not in the neighborhood, necessarily. Well, I, I might be. You tell me what city you're in, and I'll tell you if I'm in the neighborhood Baldwin. Okay. All right. Well, I, 
I did my half. Now you tell me whether you're in the city or not. <laughs> um, I am not at the funeral home, but my funeral home is just next door. I'm at home. I answer the phones at home at night. So, um, mm. but uh, how can you tell when they're really dead anyway? I mean, what do you got to do? Well, they, they don't have a pulse. <laughs> um, oh. yeah, they okay. don't have that. All right, all right. Here's what I have to do, Dave. I have to call the medical examiner. And they have to verify the death before I can do anything. Oh. Okay? Oh, okay. All right. Well, maybe I should just call them if we got to go through that. It sounds like a lot of. If you got to call them, then they got to call me, then they got to. I mean, I should. I can. You got a number for them? I'll call them and get this over with and call you back. Well, I'll call them because oh. I, num oh. I have their number right here. I have your number. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What? No, he's not. No, I checked the pulse. Well, now she's saying he's alive. Hang on a second. What? All right, my wife says he's alive. Okay. So I guess we better call somebody else. Or do you Wait. guys handle that? No, you don't handle that. No, no, that right. would be nine one one, Dave. All right, I'm gonna uh, call the nine uh, one. I know I'm on the phone. Well, after I hang up, I'll call nine one one. She's she's in a bad mood, or that. I'll call you back when he's dead. <laughs> okay.